This week on Dateline Schools, we get to talk about the Reconnect Michigan programs, an opportunity for adults to get back to college. And to tell us more about it, my special guest is the Director of Financial Aid at St. Clair County Community College in Port Huron, Joe Kassar. And Joe, what are the requirements for the these this group of students to, to meet in order to participate in this program? Okay, so in order to be eligible, students need to be at least 25 years of age, have lived in the state of Michigan for over a year, have a high school diploma or its equivalent, and have not yet earned an associate or bachelor's degree. Oh, okay, so, so we are definitely talking adult learners. Um, do they have to have any previous college experience, or is it something that they can hopefully maybe try to finish what they started earlier? Um, it's a combination. So they could have previous college experience, or they could be brand spanking new and starting off for the first time. I, any idea how that you mentioned yesterday you have about 200 students participating at St. Clair County Community College. Any idea kind of where their status was or are they all pretty much brand new students? Um, I think most are returning. I think about 60 or so for the fall semester were new students, Terry. Great. Now we got a new semester coming up in a couple of weeks, you know, second week in January, you usually start your, your next term at SC4. Is it too late for any of the Anybody to reconsider about this and maybe want to get into this program? Not at all. Um, as I said, for those students who are age 25 years or older, if they have the diploma and live in Michigan, high school diploma, I should say, and live in Michigan, they should definitely apply for the scholarship. Um, they will want to first and foremost complete the Reconnect application that can be found online at www.michigan.gov forward slash reconnect. And then if they are looking to come here at SC4, in addition to that reconnect application, they'll want to make sure that they've completed the SC4 admissions application that's found online at our website at sc4.edu, as well as completing the 21-22 FAFSA, also known as the Free Application for Federal Student Aid. More tomorrow from Dateline Schools, Terry Hunt.